Yeah, it was them. So Windows thinking no, it wasn't Windows seat. No, I can't remember. But she did do a collaboration with them at one point. So I wasn't into Roots like that. I got into Roots late. And all the other guys late. I came late on the scene. I was not into none of those musics. I wasn't allowed to listen to certain musics when I was younger. I had to do it secretly. Well, uh, not secretly, but yeah, well, but when I did get to know about certain musics, I was I think Eric Abadu was my favorite. I didn't know about Jaguar, right? Really? Oh, I was I was more into the Lauren Hill. <clears throat> Lauren Hill, the Neo Soul singers more than the um than the um than her. I never heard of her, to be honest. This is a video she performed with the roots. No, sorry, there is a video that she, yeah, I think maybe I see it. I've seen people play it. But um yeah. So that's all um, like you know me, I just wanna make just say what I'm thinking. And then I'm just gonna leave it at that. I gotta go back to writing now. I'm being mum, you hear my daughter saying the most already in the background. I'm trying to balance it out. Thank God for school tomorrow. <laughs> um, yeah, Jagger Wright is a neo singer, but she didn't make it. No, she didn't make it big because I would have seen her. I would have seen her at one point, but it's quite sad that she's gone to this level. She's gone to such a level. Lauren Hill is Lauren Hill performed. She performed. I forget where she performed, and her son came out. But that was ages ago. She's still around. Right. Yeah, so so you know, yeah, strutting, yeah, strutting ain't right there either. Yeah. No, something ain't right there. No, Lauren Hill, Lauren Hill, Lauren Hill went through a lot with her with her with Rowan Marley. She went through a lot with, with him. So um hi so Amma, she met a spiritual guru. And I don't know what happened. Plus, Rowan was um, cheating behind her back. And um, something happened and they separated. Her song, The Factor, is based on their relationship, the breakdown of the relationship, one of, one of the breakdowns. So, the, hi, we see. So, there, so, therefore, so, therefore, she was... Um, she had a breakdown and um yeah and then she started singing by herself the text thing too warren is a whole warren's changed i saw him he's totally changed he's totally different um he's making money with the coffee he's making money off the marley name that's for sure that's for sure you see it definitely the brothers the brothers like uh kamani Oh, the, oh, my daughter's singing in the background. You can hear it. Because this stream all picks up every rasp team. Um, yeah, Rowan is, a, Rowan, Rowan is bad. Rowan is very, he is a clown. He is, I can say that about Rowan. Because um, when I saw them together, I was like, ah, oh, ow, wow, oh, like, sorry, oh. <laughs> but, um, but what happened, but what happened is, um, what happened is um their 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 relationship broken down so badly. The very right that time when she did the on the one on MTV where she broke down, she was literally talking about him and stuff like that. And um, because I remember watching that on a uh, cable, and she was really tore up about a lot of things. Um, so. He really did a lot. Rowan did a lot because he was seeing. He was seeing. I think the woman he's with now—that's the woman he was seeing behind Lauren Hill's back. Yeah, X Factor. Yeah, X Factor. Yeah. So, um, she was in Jamaica with Rowan and raising children, and they broke up. And she came back to the states, but she wasn't paying taxes. She went to jail for a few months, and now she tours to pay back taxes. Yeah, but even before that, even before that, the Lauren was taken out by the system for being a non-conformist. But Lauren is always like, Lauren is always like, the X Factor song was about her and Whitecliff. Yeah, but there's another song. Got to find. 
right? She wanted. She was saying she had a song called "I Got to Find Peace of Mind" or something like that. Jealous of her success. Zion's song is about her and Rowan's first born. Yeah, yeah, it is. And um, um, the other the other Marleys apparently because of their father's thing, um, they are part of the industry so they're stuck to the industry like they have to make records they have to do certain stuff they have to like they're trying to get a business going Mali but Mali's always had the, the coffee you know being asked to do Ethiopia and stuff and um um the sons like Kamani Damien Julian uh Stephen, Ziggy, can't remember half of them, the girls. Um, you know, even in one of the past lives where I talk about where they had to take back one of the places in um Jamaica because certain things wasn't happening in Jamaica, they had to take back one of the residents places what they had. And um See, I never stick to trending things. See, that's why I don't talk about trending things because it doesn't interest. Sometimes it interests me, but I don't always want to talk about it. But um, um, but um, they 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 form such a business. They they all have a business head on them. Each one of them play a big part in their father's um in their father's legacy. That's what I see. Yeah, Marley Coffee Ziggy. Jewish now, yeah. Damien is a breaks, yeah, breaks bits, breaks fear, which apparently is higher. What breaks fear, breaks fear, which is apparently higher than a Rothschild, Stephen, and Stephen just dropped off. Yeah, Stephen dropped off. I, I don't really see nothing about Stephen. I not. I mostly see about um, Ziggy, Damien, Julian, Julian, Julian. Julian used to come over to England even for a while, for a bit, and then he stopped coming over to England. He went back. He goes to and from Jamaica. He still tours. He still does his touring and everything else with it. Then one of the sons died recently. No, I don't think so. Let me, no, I don't think no. None of them. I don't, I, no, no, no. None of the sons died. Oh yes, the grandson. The grandson. The grand. The grand. Stephen's son died just the other day um yeah they did an ethiopian orthodox send-off not higher but part of the 13 brother bloodlines ruling the world yeah joe joe mercy yeah 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 he died he died recently he was only, he was only young he was only a young guy he wasn't even old he wasn't even an old guy. Like, was it car accident or something? I can't remember what happened. But I put it up on the community tab. I remember. But uh, the sons, the sons keep the legend, the legend of Bob Marley. His name. They keep his name going, and his daughters, and um, forgot the wife. The wife, she keeps it going too. She put up with a heck of a lot. I remember reading the book. I was like, wow. She went. She put up with a lot of stuff from him. He was really terrible. Honestly, he was terrible. But the rest of the community was upset with her because she wrote the book. They wasn't feeling that she wrote that book. They, 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 um, they didn't appreciate it when because she told out all his business, all of his affairs, what he had. Every time he went to came to England to see um Cindy Breakspears and stuff. Was it Cindy Breakspear? Damien's mother. Um and then in the end and then and, and then in the end she had to she literally ended up looking after all of the children. Um Bunny Whaler was known to say that how was it Bunny Whaler or Peter Tosh? Peter Tosh said that how he was glad. I think it was Bunny Whaler. Bunny Whaler said it is good that how Bob did pass because if Bob, if Bob didn't pass, they, they would not have got a scene, they would not have got no light 
at all because Bob Marley took over the light, uh, took a lot of the um, the um, the, the what you call it off of them. So you know, yeah, Cin Cindy, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it was you who said, yeah. All the all the Morleys have sold out. You said that because because even the Rasters were said that they're not. There wasn't proper Rasters. They said that. And they, oh yeah, the video is not clickbait. The live is not clickbait. Everybody. So if you're just now coming in, I just spoke about that gene already. So yeah, yeah. Julian was born in 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 UK. I think I think he's a little boy who comes in one love. He's in the video. You see him. You see him in one love video. So um, I think it's him. It might even be him. Could be just a random little rest of the boy. But I think it. But I think that he that they was not. They they certain things they were doing. The rest of the community didn't didn't accept. They didn't see them as Rasta. They had the. Um, they believed that how. They sold out, which is what Chrissy's saying, that they sold out. And um, even now, right, pardon, my voice is shaking. Even now that how um, they can do something for Jamaica, because the reason why they took back that, that place that Sizzler got caught up in was because that they wanted to form a later business as well. And um, and um, the Rastas had an issue with them. I mean, you hear it in the recordings. Muta Baruka spoke up and spoke his piece on what was going on with the Rasta community, the division the in the Rasta community concerning, concerning certain stuff. Um, they also didn't like it when the royals went down to Jamaica and they played the Naya Bingi drum. They was really against that. They had the issue with that too because they are they they they're saying that the oppressor should not play the drum. And I agree with them right there because um, at the end of the day, a um, lot of things has happened. And Rasta normally sing Rasta Rasta been singing against oppression for lots of years, and then and then boom, that happened. Muta, Muta, Muta ain't really sell out. I wouldn't say Muta sell out. Muta, I think Muta's just just because because of who he is, he because of what type of man or who he is on a whole. Because when I saw him one time, um, he definitely when he spoke at the African Liberation Day, and he said what he said, and he said what he said. And they and they didn't stop doing African Liberation Day, and I was like, wow. But I decided not to go to none of the African Liberation Day because after he said what he said, I said, yeah, well, that's me done then. And um, I don't believe he sold that. I don't believe he sold that. Mm -mm. Um, I still think that he holds up some principles or morals on certain stuff more more than most of the modern wrestlers. I mean, Sizzler. Sizzler, for one, seems to be trying to hold up his end as a Rastaman, a Baba, a Baba Shanti priest as well. And um, um, it's just quite telling that they are, they are able to carry such, um, such stuff, carry such stigma, uh, not even stigma. They carry the thing, like keeping the fire burning. People think that how oh, yeah, right, it's to do with the weed burning and stuff like that. When you keep the fire burning, that means that how right, you burn all ends. You keep certain certain things you just don't delve in. I mean, like I said, right, right. Even when I do on that thing, what I do on the Alphabet Crew on um the other channel, most people wouldn't even cover that, but. But the reason why I covered it because I saw that it was there was a need for it, and it's not that. Well, right, I'm not saying that most things right you agree with with that with the uh, community, 
but like but with most teams you have to find out what is what it is you don't have to know about their sexual positions and all that stuff you don't need to know all that you don't need to go into that but you just need to like you know they talk about about less lesbos the amount the place as well so from what i remember from um being around the conscious community so but the reason why i went and i tried to educate myself not only that on here i met a few of them and they're okay they don't they don't do me no no bad way they don't you know so um i decided to go and look on the download men's stuff and that like that but like was up i will i'm gonna bring it back to the rest of the community because the rest of the community don't deal with that they don't they don't they don't deal with that at all that's why i was shocked when i heard that one of the artists the biggest artist coffee well i should have guessed <laughs> i should have guessed coffee who she is the one way the way she was dressed because i always said why is she dressed like a boy she was dressed like a boy and when when queen africa spoke out i said yeah <laughs> i said I, I noticed it I noticed it, but then Queen Africa said it's the leopard, the leopard top that they wear. She said it's the leopard top. That's how you know what they are. And I said, oh, but I should have guessed that coffee was what she was. But I didn't because because the music was the way it was. Like you know, everybody plays coffee music. I wasn't even I wasn't even looking at what she was wearing. To be honest, I wasn't checking all that. But I had I guess she was who she was. And when Queen Africa called it out, I said, yeah, <laughs> I agreed with her on that because, but she said there's a lot of things that goes on behind the scenes in the reggae, in the reggae community, the reggae industry. So when she called it, I said, wow. And then Tonya Stevens came out and said what she said. And then I think somebody else came out and they said what they said. I said, yeah, okay. And then Sisla went and burned up the thing with Khalid. And I said, mm-hmm. So what's happening? They're they're trying to they're trying to keep a an what's it an utterance then in the air. They're trying to keep keep it straight, in it. So you know, Sizzler, Sizzler, the only thing I big him up for, the only thing I big him up for was the fact that he um he helps the youth in Jamaica. He's trying to get a coffee. A coffee company right after himself he's trying to do that so yeah um queen africa is, is talking hard to the gov of, to the prime minister over there she is she's not playing with the prime minister over there she la lewis ain't playing with them um there's a lot of things going on in Jamaica. Like I said, if I follow everything, I'll be putting out videos on them every single day. Because um, she stood there with the mothers crying of that girl, what happened to that young lady. And um, she sounded her voice because she growls. She don't talk, she growls. And um, she sounded her voice to such a pitch that even as you're watching the video, you feel the utterance in her in her voice, and um, she spoke out. She's she speaks out on a lot of things. She speaks out on a lot of things. She don't really hold back. One time they thought she they she cut her. They put up, she did a TikTok and they thought she cut her hair, and she said, "But wait, underneath all these clothes, what what's it? What 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 I wear? What I wear? Do you not think that?" how right there's not a pretty body under there or something like that because most rest of go go for women who who's not who's not got looks and you know they're very out there so some rest of shall i say some rest of them. so when she said that i was like yeah because it's true it's true sizzler's wife is not it's not dread she's not a rasta she's uh she does she's a weave wearing girl or wig wearing girl however so when she said that, I was like, yeah, because, you know, they, I mean, like, they will have the rest of the woman at home and they'll be out cheating with with a woman that don't even look like that. So um, that's the size of it. But like I said, Queen Africa sounds her voice on a lot of stuff. She does. And I'm going to do a live on the one the time when i got time. 
she sounds her voice on a lot of things. She sounds her voice on a lot of things. She don't take no prisoners. And well, rightly so. Um, Tonya Stevens is quieted down. I don't really hear from Tonya Stevens. I don't really see her. But the other day they had a sun splash or something in Jamaica recently. Ruti Mai was, was there and everything else. So they're trying. The concert did look good. So, yeah. Oh, Sizzler on that coffee thing too. Yeah, Sizzler's trying to get a coffee company. He have it in the area where he at in the grill, where he is. So he was making the young men plow the land and um, get it ready for growing stuff. And he fixed the water bank in the area. He did, he did a whole conservation of the land. He didn't really, he, he's got videos of that up. I'm glad I went ball behind these. Yeah, there is fake grasses, but there's real ones as well. There's real ones. It's just finding them. They're, they're very rare. Finding a real Rasta person on something who's about something is very rarity, very rare. So I normally follow Priest Kalash, Honourable Priest Kalash. Uh, I was following Isaac and um, I forgot the other guy. He also does on alkaline food, not alkaline, he does on foods and drinks and stuff. And um, yeah, so uh, I follow a lot of, I follow a lot of bubbles. I follow a lot of them. A lot of bubbles. Um, the rest of the community is vast. Everybody thinks that how they look one way. They don't look one way. There's many houses. So, um, they disagree with a lot of stuff. There's a lot of disagreeables within that community and there's a lot of agreeables. So it's finding the genuine ones, the ones who's not womanizing, the ones who's not um who's doing what they're supposed to be doing. And um a lot of them has, has gone back to Africa, Shashamani. Um but even there they're doing the most over there. So you know, it's a it's a it's a it's a deep it's a it's one of those ones, isn't it? So, um, as I keep saying. But I might just have to do a live predominantly on Jamaica. I mean, I'm not a Jamaican, but my mum is is a citizen over there. So, um, like I said, a lot of Jamaican news, a lot of Jamaican things happen, a lot of um, stuff happen. The EWF need looking at behind Madonna activity. There was an EWF that came on one 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 platform I was around. I wasn't sure whether which EWF it was, because I know they have many locations, many locals. And um um I'm surprised. Even if that if that is going on, I'll be I'm surprised. But you might have to send me the details on that one because that is speculating because I know somebody from EW. Well, she was part of EWF, she's not part of it no more but she's kind of she kind of devils i could ask her because i'm sure they're not about that life because um they're not for madonna and all that it's a jamaican man thing you know well yes it is it is it is it is but there was somebody that came on to uh ice ice jar i think his name is ice jar star platform and she said she was from ewf and um, I think she was talking on this platform a couple times, so I don't know. But there's a lot, but like I said, there's a lot of disagreeables in Shashamani. Um, there's something, there was a coup going on in Shashamani at one point. Um, yeah, yeah, it's Jamaican man. And, um, and um, they had a coup over there, a coup over there. Um, I don't think he hit a lot of the areas in Ethiopia. I don't think Shashamani was hit because I because I ain't hear nothing. So um, yeah, but um, Sizzler, Sizzler, uh, uh, Sizzler, when he went to Gambia and everything, he start. I think he started to change a little bit more 
in his thinking. I don't know. He just wanted to do more for the country. That's what I see, or from the place where he lived. So he, like I said, he got a lot of boys down there fixing land, probably working for him. You know what I mean? And um, to me, that is constructive. High hood therapy, <coughs> that is constructive. And to be honest, I'm not a rest myself. I used to be a rest. I used to be a rest Um It's good when you see grown men doing stuff for young men because a lot of young men falls under the street. They fall under a lot of stuff, a lot of vices. And I mean, young, young women as well. They need that, right? There is women trying to do stuff with young women, but they fall, there's a lot of vices out there that grabs them. Social media is one of them. Even me, a big person on social media, never saw what I see today. So um, there's a lot of vices out there. So him, by him doing what he's doing, plus I think he's been with that woman for a long time, that lady that he's been with. He's been with her for a long time. The woman who I thought was his missus isn't his missus. But he's been with her for a very long time. I'm sure his son is big now. Ethiopia is the only country never enslaved by the West. The beat the Italians. Yeah, I heard about that. The Battle of Adwa as well. I heard about that. I heard about that. And um, um, so um, there is a lot that is to be said, a big conversation. I don't, like I said, if I didn't see this mental health girl there now I won't be talking about her this her situation but the situations there we all fallen under we're like we're taking people they turn on you whatever 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 and I feel this is the same situation that's going to happen now there's a whole heap of issues going on like I said in previous and um yeah so I'm not clickbaiting people by the way I ain't clickbaiting it just the conversation moved on. <laughs> but if you do want to talk about Jamaica and stuff like that, because, like, I know there's a lot of Jamaicans that subs to me. Um, I was talking about L.A. Lewis at one point because L.A. Lewis was doing the identification card so that you could not get that thing. And um, he since then his work's got moved on and gone to bigger things now. He's helping people out, he's helping people with funerals, he's feeding people on roads, feeding homeless. He's doing a lot of stuff. He's doing a lot of stuff. He's talking out against 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 the prime minister and the whole of the government. He's doing a lot of um a lot of work. And um, like I said, you can't wait for a person to die or pass away before you talk about them. You have to talk about them when, when they're alive. And that's the thing that we always do, is wait to when they're passed and we talk about them. You have to talk about them when they're alive before they even go to the next the next life or wherever they're supposed to go. But um, I believe in that. So, um, yeah. There's a new revolution about chicken oh crime tv oh yeah i heard about him i think he's the same one he's speaking out against the western okay there's a lot of people speaking out against the western world they speak about they speak about the returnees and stuff like that there's a lot of cutthroat going on behind the scenes in africa so people is making their way to Africa themselves. Um, there's a lot of stuff going on, a lot of to and fro with the, the Americans and the Africans. Oh, it's crazy. I, on the other hand, ain't getting into all that mishmash. <laughs> I have my opinion on that one, but I ain't getting into all that mishmash. <coughs> yeah, um, apparently, so let's see went he exiled to england and he went to the un and stuff and left his people in famine i know rasters would disagree with me when i say that but he but he did he left his people in famine while he was over here exiled 
And um, when you bring that up amongst the wrestlers, them they don't like it. They don't talk about it. That's one thing they don't talk about. They see him as the higher, a higher source. That's how they see Selassie. And um, Selassie, he's just another icon. Basically, he's just another icon. Like Grand Black History, so called Black History Month. When they bring it up, I just, I mean, I don't do Black History Month. Um, yeah, he went to Bath. I seen the place. They still got that place going all now in Bath. <laughs> they go and they do bingies there every single, I think, oh, his birthday, every July. I think his birthday's in July. They go there, they do bingies in Bath every single year. Um, you cannot go, you cannot say to Rastaman certain stuff about Selassie. They just come down and just cuss you out. Um they said that people is against the king, but it's not like he's not like against the king, he's calling out pure facts. Ethiopians do not see Selassie as a whatever, however, however, however he is looked upon. But he's just one of the icons, I will say. So um yeah, so um so I just think so I just think that how there is a bigger picture to everything. Like even how the rest is what started off in England. They started they started off in a small house, because I read the book by Jabon. Jabon said they started off in a small house and then they gradually, gradually moved to where they got they got that big place in Kennington. Then Selassie sent a paper to say that that land was for the Rasses only, but then they lost it. And um, they lost Kennington. Um, they, 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 set up, they set up shop in a house. That's how they made their temple. And then um, they did loads of meetings about certain things about, you know, politics and where women stand and stuff like that. And then um, they set it up in Kennington. Kennington had three houses to themselves, three houses. And it was all legal, even though they, you could say that they um, they took it over falsely or whatever. My daughter's coming back. I can hear it. Yeah, I used to get my vegetables in Kennington. Yeah, I remember going to Kennington. Oh, it's one hour already. I remember going to Kennington and I saw the three houses. Uh, I didn't see the Bubba Dread um, part, but I saw the rest of the part because they all con they all congregate in there. And because of due to their whatever, they lost the place. And um, there was a lot of uh, politics going on in Kennington, and um, they lost the place. So that seed was used to fool black people and it worked very well anyways i'm gonna come off anyway right because i don't i didn't plan to stay on here for long i'm gonna come off because my daughter's calling me right now so i'll have to have this conversation another time i just thought i just was coming on talking about jaguar white but obviously i'm not supposed to talk about her so this video might be deleted but it's um really good talking to you because we because we don't normally talk about UK, we always talk about the US. Um we need to talk about the UK a little more, I suppose. Because even I even I even I do it. I talk about the US a lot. But um we need to have these discussions because there's many people who who is part of the rest of the community. Judy Walmart was tripping when she says she saw holes. No, no, there's no holes in this. When you look in when you look in the um in the archive when he come when he went to Jamaica, you don't see no holes in his hand. <laughs> she really was tripping or something. She must have been, but in her eyes she saw the savior. Yeah. There is a lot going on stateside, a lot. A lot. There, Jamaica and other parts. Oh, okay, okay. I know, but you got to... actually, actually, yeah. Actually, that's what I'm gonna do. That's what I'm gonna do. I edit it. Yeah. Um. Yeah, and in the part where my daughter came, will come in and make up noise. 
Um, yeah, so, um, yeah, there is a lot that's going on stateside. There's a whole lot, but there's a lot that goes on over here too. Um, there, I mean, like I said, there was a whole py- there's a whole pyramid in Jubilee. There's a whole py- silver pyramid in Jubilee, Jubilee somewhere. But you can see where the Freemasonry is and stuff like that in England. You know, you just got to look. Um, so... Yeah, but I am going to go anyway because my little one is once in my attention and I've been telling her to, uh, you know, don't do that. He's eating. So I'm going to go as she wants my attention. You know what I mean? Because I'll be telling her to go back to the front room and all that. What's this? I'll throw it at him. So, yeah, so I'm going to come off and I'll see everybody who stuck around. Okay, so I'm going to edit. Oh, yeah, I'll just edit it. Okay, um, so with that said, I will see you. Look, I think I did highlight some of what you said. I think I did. I can't remember. But anyways, I'll see it when I do it. Okay, all right. Take care, everybody. Bye. Let's talk about, I'll talk about the number of times, Christy, because... Um, I've got to go because little one's really, she's, she's here now. So I'll see you. Bye.